Yeah, hello everyone. You're welcome once more again to my more exam prep up. Today we are going to solve a problem on logarithm. Okay, make sure after watching this video you hit the like button and subscribe to this channel where you have lots of problems on maths. Okay, across different topics. You can go topic by topic. Whichever topic you have in challenges, you watch them and uh, learn from the equations. Alright, so today we have a question on the board. If A is equals to log C base B and B is equals to log A base C and C is equals to log B base A, we have to prove what? That when you multiply A, B and C, it's going to give us what? So this is a problem on proof. Now, we are going to do this in two simple steps. Alright, the first thing is a is what log c b is what b so i'm going to substitute this so i have this as log c base b okay multiply dot means multiplication b means what log a b c so i have log a b c multiply the dot here means multiply now for c i'm going to substitute so i have log what b base a is equals to what one so from this how do we solve further all right so my next step is we want to apply a law of logarithm so what law are we going to apply okay we are going to apply change of base what law change of what base law so let me explain what change of base law means of course if i have log a base b we can write this as log a divided by what log b so log a divided by log b so this can be written as this and this can be written as this so we are going to apply to each of these all right so let's apply it now applying it, I can see that this, writing it in this form, okay, this form, is going to be log what? Log C divided by what? Log B. So multiply. What about this? If I to write it in this form, it's going to be log what? Log A divided by what? Log C. Multiply by what? This, writing it in this form, is going to be what? log b divided by what log a remember everything is equals to one yes so at this point what can we do okay we can further simplify now i can see some things can cancel out this can cancel out this is one one okay is there another thing that can cancel out yes I can see this can cancel out this is one one okay what about this sure they can cancel out so log b can cancel out log b so we have just ones left so one multiply one multiply one is one one multiply one multiply one is one which is equals to one so of course one over one is one which is equals to what one so with this we have been able to prove, okay, that A multiply B multiply C is equals to 1. Because after solving the left-hand side of the equation, we got 1, which is equals to 1 on the right-hand side. All right, so for, from what we have done, we have been able to prove, okay, that A times b times c is equals to 1 given those conditions of logarithm all right thank you guys for watching this video hit the subscribe button make sure you share this video to your friends your families your loved ones and watch out for more videos thanks for watching bye